I've just stopped all the protesters got sent to four, five years in prison for bringing you and um, so I'm going to start that again. So, just last week, <laughs> five Just Stop Oil protesters got sentenced to four and five years in prison for bringing the M25 to a standstill. I know there could be numbers. So, you might remember this ringleader, 22 year old Cressida Gathin. We are currently on a gantry above the M25. So, Cressida, uh, you know you protest, and now it's time to take responsibility for your actions. But Cressy's mummy has decided to speak out. She's not happy that her little girl has been sent down. Cressida grew up in the countryside and is one of those nature-loving defendants that you've heard about. She is an extremely talented musician. She worked hard growing up. She achieved highly. She has ambitions, dreams and hopes, like all young people. She had just finished her first year at university. She has the courage of a lion and a moral compass that compels her to step forward when she sees wrong. I mean, it's not hard to see where she gets that whopping great big sense of entitlement from, is it? <laughs> she even had the gall to complain that Cressy would miss her brother's wedding. Ah, yeah. oh, well, here's some of the harm that she caused by blocking the M25, all right? And this was actually read out in court. Missed flights, missed funerals, school children, children missing exams, somebody suffering an aggressive form of cancer missed their appointment and was forced to wait two months for another one. So, excuse me, Cressy's mummy, if I don't bring out the teeny tiny violin. Uh, your views on this, Carol. Cressy's mum. Well, the, the judge has sent them down to a guy called Chris Hay here. He's my hero, this guy. He's the right. first judge that's had the guts to do this. And he's done exactly what the British people have wanted to see for a long time. Because I'm sick, and I'm sure a lot of people are, of seeing these protesters go to court, get a smack on the wrist, come out, punch the air because they're not going to prison. Well, now they are. And, I mean, this, this uh, you read out some of the things that the, the, that, that particular protest did. It cost multi-millions. It cost the cops millions the pounds themselves from their own budget they they endangered life you know they, they get, they're perfectly entitled to endanger their own but one of those could have fallen off the gantry into a car and caused a massive pile yeah. on the m25 so you know the, the endanger your own lives but don't endanger the lives of innocent motorists and other people yes it's right but you know what under this labor government she, she, chrissy's mom shouldn't worry because she'll be out on the streets in about in about five months time. Well, so. we'll see won't we Benjamin